you just adopted a new dog and are wondering what to do now, don't worry. Here are some tips to help you get started off on the right foot and paw with your new dog. The first few nights can be overwhelming for you and the dog. Ever move to a new city where you didn't know anyone? That could be how your dog is feeling. It's actually normal for them to be a little stressed the first night. Heavy panting, dilated pupils, heavy shedding are clues that he is stressed. Keeping your household calm and quiet can help your new pooch relax in his new environment. A super stress relieving activity is to play some quiet classical music while just hanging out. Hold off on stressful events like having a lot of friends over, giving a bath, or running the vacuum cleaner. Those things can come later once he's more settled in. It's equally important to supervise him consistently the first few days to make sure he doesn't get into any bad habits early on. Baby gates or exercise pins are great at keeping them in the same room as you. A dog that wanders off into the next room could be doing something naughty. If you do catch your dog doing something naughty, stay calm and don't yell. Remember, he's still learning his new house rules. Instead, focus on showing him what he's done right. Give him a treat for doing things like peeing outside or sitting calmly next to you. This helps build a trusting relationship from day one. Baby gates can often be found in thrift stores for only a few dollars. A fine, thrifty purchase that will make your life so much easier. Doing a round of dog proofing in your home can prevent your pooch from dabbling in new bad habits. If you prevent him from getting something yummy off the countertop, he'll be less likely to countersurf in the future. A cracked door or a fumbled leash can mean one thing for a newly adopted dog. Opportunity to explore their new turf without you. Keep a firm grip on that leash and a close eye on them when people come and go from the house. A baby gate or exercise pin works great as a backup security system. If your dog does find a way to escape his new residence, hold back on that instinct to chase him. This could frighten him, or he might think it's a fun game of chase. If he's close, try kneeling down and coax him with a soft voice. If he's on the move, keep an eye at a distance and ring up the shelter. Many times, a staff member that the dog knows well will be happy to come out and help you catch him. If you have another dog at home, feed them separately. Do this for at least a few days until you feel confident that they won't get into an argument over food. Don't take it personally if he doesn't snuggle in bed with you right away. Do you fall in love on a first date? Probably not. A bond doesn't always happen within the first week, so give him time to get to know you. Patience and understanding are the keys to a successful beginning to this relationship. Happy bonding! Be sure to keep an eye out for new webisodes each month. Questions about house training, chewing, and much more will be covered in future webisodes of Home for Good. Just subscribe to our YouTube channel to get the latest updates.